There's so much fur from all the Velcro. Yikes. Hey guys, so today I have a craft update. I have a ton of stuff, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I really hope you enjoy this video. So first, I have this coin pouch that actually broke. So yeah, yikes. I can't use it, but I will be making this wallet later. I just don't feel like I'm making a wallet right now, and I really need to film this craft update so I can put these wallets away. So, yeah. Then I have two inside out wallets. So the first one is this one and has two card pockets, a short, a Ziploc coin pouch, and an ID. And back here is clear taped. And all the chrome that you see is clear taped. And then I have this one. This one is not for sale because um, the Ziploc is actually broken. If you can tell right there, it won't zip, so yeah, but all the chrome and all the blue is clear taped, but it sounds super strong, it's so confusing, in an ID, and it's clear taped back there. Next, I have business card holders. I only can find a few right now. Yeah, yikes, oh well. So first I have this one, all clear taped with gold. Looks really pretty. I'm out of gold. I really need some gold. And then this one with black. And then this camo with black too. I was about to say blue. And I had another one, but I don't know where it went at this moment. Probably in the trash because it wasn't for sale. Just kidding. It's right here. Found it. Um, This is not for sale because it's peeling. And it's all clear tape too, so... I don't know, but it's not for sale. Next, I have two kids' wallets. So the first one is, whoa, sorry, my light. Um, this with blue, s'mores with blue, pastel blue, and then Dollar Tree tape with baby pink. And then I have a lot of mini accordions. Um, and I would definitely recommend contacting me fast um, if you want to order because everyone has contacted me all at once and a lot of these wallets are sold. So I would definitely contact me quick if you would like to order because these wallets are going pretty fast, just so y'all know. I have this Spongebob one with bubblegum pink. And then I have um, this one, multicolored lace with pink and green apple, just one little accent. This one with an ID. All the chrome that you touch is clear taped. Then there's this one, color combo credit goes to Crazy Crafty Llama. And there's this one. This is my favorite wallet. I love this wallet. With Galaxy, all the chrome that you touch is clear taped. Then I have this one. It's mashup with teal. I used a lot of tape up this week. And I, I've been buying a lot of tape. And it's made me realize that I really need to start using tape up. Because... I have no more room for it, like, whatsoever. Like, I'm struggling right now to even fit this duct tape anywhere, so. And then the last one is this one. This is a transparent tape, and I actually really like this tape and this wallet, so. And then, um, to finish up the roll of mashup, I made two bows. They're not really that good, but I did make two bows. Because now I have finished the whole roll. Then I have this. And I... Um, this was not in the sale video because I originally I did not like the wallet. So then I was like, oh, I can redo it. So I redid it. So this is back for sale. Um, but yeah, it's one of these things. Woman's wallet. It's six inches, which is the length of your bills. So that might be a problem. I don't know. I haven't tested it out, but it's all lined up and clear taped with regular pink and bubblegum pink. There's five card pockets 
and the ID, the billfold, two expandables, and the Ziploc coin pouch. But I, um, originally when I made this wallet, I did not like it, but I redid the whole outside panel, and I really like the wallet now, so, um, contact me if you want to order this. I don't know how much it's going to be, I still have to decide, maybe like $10 shipped or something, because I really like this wallet. Then I have this cube from Dean Craft Tutorial. It's so addictive. Um, I don't know if I'm going to make these for, like, people, I don't know. Depends if you want one. If someone contacts me, I'll probably make them one, but, like, I don't know. It will definitely be better than this, because this was my first one, and I wasn't even, like, trying for anyone. So, like, if you do want to order one, it'll be better, but I don't think anyone will really want to order one. I don't know. It's very time-consuming, so if you want to make one, then give yourself plenty of time to make one. And then, lastly, I have this clutch. Thing. It's 8x5 and this is not for sale because my school is having a fashion show and I was asked to make clutches for the models to wear or to hold down the runway. So this is my clutch that I made. It's a new arabesque tape with icy blue and there's a lot of fuzz from the velcro so sorry about that. But yeah, it just looks like this. It's really nice. All seams are clear taped. And, yeah, I'm going to be making more because I really do need to make more. Um, I don't know how many I have to make, but I do have to make a lot, so there's that. So, I believe that is all for this craft update. If you do want to purchase anything, please contact me because, like I did say for my sale video, things are going really quickly. Um, so, I would definitely... Um, hit me up while you can. Custom orders are open. Yeah, but if you do want to buy anything, like, contact me really fast because these are going, guys. Like, they are. So, contact me. Please subscribe, and I will catch you guys later. Peace.